Hello some viewers how are you all welcome back to another video guys in this video we are going to discuss how to create or insert a document so now let us create a insert create or insert a document let me write here create so how we normally create right in mongodb compose let me close this let me open this one so here we have a channel playlist right click on the channel playlist you can see we can add the data here like import for answer document if you click on this here by mongo db compass we will insert the document like this but how we can do that in express in Mo by using mongos right so let me copy a playlist so now i'll give a simple playlist name so i have a vb script playlist in my as a techno code channel so i'll write this as new here i have to take the channel playlist as my reference so channel playlist i have to copy the same thing what you have given here instead here instead of giving the data types i will give the names so name of the channel here i'll write it should be a string as a techno coder number of videos in that vb script playlist i think that's a number so 30 i think 43 are there currently so other is string so it is as her and active is true still that playlist i am adding more and more videos right so i'll save this think here we should add this vb script playlist dot you have to save this if you don't save it i don't think it would come up you have to save this adding a, a method so one of the things in the model right i think if you see the document it should be always in the capital letters right so i think we have to write a channel playlist as capital c and i think we have to give the same here capital c i think here also the same capital c now the vb script playlist can be in a camel case right so let me clear the screen now save this now let me run it here now the connection should come successful now let me disconnect this let me get a a um, new connection or maybe i can uh, connect this again now here i have to see in the test schema see the document is generated the same thing i have as a techno coder so what if i want to add another one but let me add uh, let me keep channel a other as b so now what if i want to print what document is typed here right for that we have many things guys let us see so i want to save this document right so let me write constant dot equal to i'll put here await so await will always work with async right so we have to create a function so i'll write it here constant insert doc equal to i have created a sync function here a sync function arrow function so i'll write it here open bracket close bracket in the open bracket close bracket i can put this and i can add it here at the end so now what it does here i can put console dot log of doc right so let me add this right so let me add this i have to call this function also right so insert doc so i am i have defined it i am now calling it also so now let me write insert so here you can see it has now added a document so number of videos 43 or 3 is b active is equal to true channel is a so now i have to disconnect this don't think it will work on reload okay let's see reload data yeah it worked so if you reload data also it is working so i have added the same thing 
so what if i give the wrong data types okay so let me disconnect the connection cls few things i will only change the true to true to true right mm -hmm. so so it should throw me an error right see here and always connection is successful but something is failing right see here unhandled exception true is not defined because true is a boolean value so now we'll do one more thing so when we add nothing function it's better to add a try and class block right so try will always execute the code if it has an error it will throw an error as simple as that so let me do a proper indent entry huh? so here tab i think i should give a tab here too and then so try is always followed by catch so i'm catching the error i'll put in error so i'll put console dot log error so now if i want to execute the same thing right so now it's control s so i have to save this so now let me execute it so catch should give an error so true is not defined so true should be like this so now it connects although the connection is successful we are getting an error so now let me insert this document so okay i didn't save it so let me now execute it so now i have added another document so i don't know how many documents i have added by the way so let me uh, reload this data even though data is same the object id will be unique that is you can say that it has a foreign key so that's it for the video guys if you like the video please click on like if you're a new viewer please click on subscribe till then guys take care have a great day bye bye